Any news from Jack? There's a statewide APB out on him. Jack's okay. He has something up his sleeve. He's not worried about being caught. So how do we help? We go after the other side of the equation. Jack has a lesion and its cronies running scared. We go after the doctor and some of the other guys. But the whole department breathing down our necks. It's time for action, Herschel. It's time for change. Jack's crossed the Rubicon and we have to be on the other side ready to help him. Christ, what was that? An explosion. Something big. You think it's the Reds? You think those rusky sons of bitches that dropped the H-bomb on us? Calm down, Herschel. We need to be ready for the call. I'm not waiting for an invitation. Get in the car and head for the cloud. KGPL can give us the details on the way. That looked like a fucking nuclear room. You like to leave your mark, don't you? All units, car 88K reports an explosion downtown, repeating 88. Jesus, what the fuck? That is some nuclear shit. We have looters around the corner. Cuff them or put them down. We need to get this area under control. You don't shoot at cops, you little prick. Get that bastard, Cole. Now ain't the time to be looking for a profit, asshole. I got no time for chasing. <laughs> I'm hiding behind fucking. Uh, what You're it was sorry, it? Uh... Son of a bitch. Yeah. By the way, I checked off screen where I know this guy see. from. Let's go. Where where I know Bigs from? Uh... Jesus, I never seen nothing like this. I wish I could say the same. It's like a bomb's gone off. Jesus Christ. Poor people. We gotta find out what went down. You ever seen uh, the Batman movie with the Joker, the Dark Knight? You're late, Phelps. Get delayed somewhere? So. What in yeah, God's from name there. happened here? It wasn't nuclear. If it was, we'd all be dead from the radiation. That's reassuring. What's radiation? Everyone inside the factory was vaporized. I mean, look at the size of that crater. What's going on over there? The mayor is going on television, appealing for calm. Television? We can afford one of those things. Anything to go on? We're looking at the remains of Nicholson electroplating. I have an idea of what might have caused the explosion, but I'm only guessing. Have a look around the rubble, see if you come up with anything. But yeah, uh, you remember that Worlds scene? Turn upside down, Cole. Then it's time for us to do our jobs. Then let me finish my fucking sentences. Oh, brother. So that scene that the Joker is uh, in a not in a cell, but in the interrogation room. And there's a guy guarding him, and he tells the Joker tells him, "Do you know why I use a knife?" That's well, it, Mr. Mayor. We're wrapped. You know. Well, good. And then he asks, "Thank you very much, son. Did you think it went okay?" Couple of hiccups, sir, but that's to be expected. Nobody's ever done this before. We'll get mm. better with practice. Don't think this is any that use to us. That maybe goes to me too, son. Should have played it a little more somber. What do you think, son? Uh, no, Mr. Mayor, you came across as, um, very resolute. Right, so he asked, the Joker asked the... The guarding guy, uh, How many friends did he kill? Whatever. How many of your friends did I kill? And then he tells him six, he's like, you know that scene? So this is the garden guy. <laughs> Sweet heavens above. Told you I know him. Just didn't remember from where. Phelps! 
I think I found something over here. Looks like all that's left. I can try the laundry tag. Where did, what did you find and where? Because I found that shirt, not you. Detective, you seen this yet? Come take a look. Blew the locker open, but shielded the contents. Let's see what we got in here. Oh, only OSS agents use these things. We'll need to get the film developed to see if there's an espionage angle. Any ideas, Herschel? None that I care to utter for public consumption. What is that thing? Oh, I just pop it in. What is it? A substitution cipher. The Germans used them in the war. These are cipher rings. You know what to do with them? Maybe. I used them in OCS. Okay. This first so letter H... is a cipher key. The rest of the message should align itself. H equals K, I guess. Uh, H equals K and one three three so that K is actually an H H S B O J L H Q I guess uh, no. Sure. Huh? I don't know. I really don't know. Rotate right outer wheel to the first letter on the cipher. I did, didn't I? Okay, I guess I did not. So is it K? Okay. What? I don't get it. I am So S. S is the second letter, I guess. I'm looking if something changes. We have the letter N now at the top. Okay, N V. Sure. And then we get B. Okay. And then we get O. Is it never? J. L K L K North Vermont maybe Sure Space X S B X Avenue S B Yeah should be Avenue It's an address one three three North Vermont Avenue Wait. Wait, I'm not done. 
There was the dot or note. Tamako Akamato, Japanese name. Okay, now we're done. I guess. Is there anything else here? Jeez. Are you hungry, Flaps? The fuck? Holy blah blah. No good to me. Right now, it's no good for anyone. <laughs> Jesus. I would be surprised if there's someone alive here. Except for the investigating officers and whatnot. Oh, hello. Doesn't tell me anything. Okay. I thought maybe it was uh, some extra spy equipment. What, the shoe? It's probably someone's like shoe. Looks like a shoe. Come on, Flaps. I thought four Vicks was a tough break. Jeez. I think... Here's another theory. Sometimes I get something right. I think this explosion is caused on purpose, obviously on hey, purpose. Hey, detective! I think I got something here! Okay. Um, to distract us and point us in a wrong direction, you know what I mean? Like a diversion thing? Don't think this is anything. So everyone will be busy with this and not with uh, Leland and his friends. Any idea what this is? A very large egg cup? A Viking helmet? How would I know, Phelps? No, it's a shell put case. Put it back together. Most likely. Looks to me like some kind of machine component. An airplane part, maybe. What? Wasp thing? I think it's a shell case. Or something. They tested the, the wasp and it stinged. Yep, and people died. That's what I think, though. And I'm probably wrong about it, but I don't care. Jesus. Can it get any worse? No, no, I should not ask that question. <laughs> the answer is always yes. What the fuck, Flaps? But yeah, you should tip for life, okay? Never ask can it get any worse. Never, whatever you do, do ev do not ever ask that question. The answer is always yes. Always. Doesn't matter in in how much shit you are in right now. Be grateful, like, wow, Car bear your cross with pride, you know, it's, it's hard, it's tough, but, Jesus, I mean, yeah, what, whatever you're feeling right now and however tough Nicholson. things are for you. This is your place? What's left of it? 32 years of work up in smoke. But as, a, as I was saying, yeah, don't, don't even look to other people. People love to compare themselves to others instead of comparing themselves to themselves, like who they were and who they are now and who can they, who can, who they can be tomorrow. It's like, Jesus, that, that is hectic enough for each individual before even starting to comparing yourself to others especially since you don't know who those others really are 
since you never walked one minute in their shoes. However successful or unsuccessful the they are. Yeah, I have the pieces to pick up here. Yeah, sorry, I was rambling. Can you tell us what happened here? Our uh, chief chemist, Harold McClellan, was using this area to test the, the new process. And what exactly is this new process? Uh, that's uh, classified information, son. Seriously? Okay. We got a laundry tag, we got a spy camera, espionage, deciphered message, that we got the airplane part, we got some evidence, we might say, you're lying motherfucker, so we're gonna say that, if it won't go anywhere, we'll just doubt. Tell us the truth, Mr. Nicholson, you're making bombs for the military, and this was some kind of an accident. Your pitch is high and wide, kid. Look, we do plenty of work for the military and for aircraft manufacturers, but it's all polishing and plating. There are no bombs here. What is this then? Hmm? Hmm? I... I don't know for sure. But my guess, it's like a fucking shell of a bomb. Or something. But it just might be a part of an airplane. Like it says, airplane part. I don't maybe. I don't know. Looks like I was mistaken. I, I'm not for I'm not sure. I'll go with doubt. A lot of people died here, Mr. Nicholson. I'm prepared to go to the press and tell them it was your fault. What is the new process? A way to chemically polish aluminum. It's traditionally done by hand. It's extremely labor-intensive. The process could be worth millions. Who is Tamako Akamoto? Dr. McClellan's personal assistant. She came highly recommended. Akamoto was involved in industrial espionage. Was she working for you or for a foreign government? That's a ridiculous assertion. How can you possibly say she was a spy? How many of your other employees carry spy cameras in their handbags? Oh, Jesus, Mary and Joseph, she was selling me out. If she wasn't a foreign spy, who could she have been working for? There could be other plating companies, uh, but the big customers for the process are the aircraft manufacturers. Lockheed, Boeing, Hughes, North American. What can you tell us about McClellan? A brilliant chemist. He approached me a few months ago with the idea for the new process. So no one has ever done this before? No, but it's legitimate research. You sure this wasn't some kind of insurance play gone wrong? Come clean about it, Mr. Nicholson, and it will go better for everyone. You have some basis for that accusation, do you, Sonny? Oh, no. I do not. It's nothing personal. I'm just doing my job. You understand that? I, I just thought he would share more info that could apply to a clue. So you thought McClellan could do what no one else could do? You were prepared to take that risk. Look, he is a... was... A trained chemist, and his ideas could revolutionize electroplating. Mm. And you would be rich. I'm a businessman. What's wrong with turning a buck? You blew up six blocks! And God knows how many people are dead. I regret that. That's laudable. We'll be in touch, Mr. Nicholson. Can you send us Dr. McClellan and Miss Akamoto's personnel files? I will if I can find them. By the way, we also found the collar of a shirt. It has a laundry tag. They're likely to be Dr. McClellan. And the majority of people who worked here don't use a laundry service. Interesting. Okay. I thought we had like the 
our captain or whatever dude want to talk to us once we're done, but he didn't. Obviously, I cannot use that yet. Uh, I don't care about the vehicle. I was hoping that it will show me like a, you know, a phone or something. Not. Oh, there is a phone over there. I see it uh, shining. Like a beacon. I wonder if there will be like calls now with the bomb blowing off and whatnot. At least the streets are clean. And no cars. Detective Phelps, badge 1247. How could I help, Detective? Can you speak to someone at the Army Air Force Base for me, please? Of course, Detective. Tell them I have what I believe is an aircraft part. It's polished metal, light for its size, and it looks like a cone of some sort. It's stamped on the inside, PNW Wasp Major R4360. I'll get back to you, Detective, when you check in for messages. Anything else? I need an address for Superior Laundry Services. Closest store to your location is in Wilshire, 4766 Melrose Avenue. Thanks for your help. Okay.